Set them over there. Thank you. Corporal St. John, this is Dr. Jimenez. St. John? Hey, Doc. This is Deacon. What can I do for you? St. John, good. I need you to stop by the infirmary. Uh, is something wrong? You need something? No, no. Nothing like that. I want to check on that arm. My arm? My, my arm's fine, Doc. <laughs> a burn like that? From a wood stove? It's nothing to play around with. You want La Infección? You come see me. That's in order. All right, Doc. All right, fine. Whatever you say. St. John out. Hey, Doc. Uh... Come in. Siéntese. Have a seat. Have a seat. Mm -hmm. oh. Let's look here. So, who did you ride with back in the day? Uh, <laughs> I don't know what you're uh, getting at. No me mientas. Look, Corporal. I spent 20 years in East L.A. patching up bandas de motoristas and every other kind of pandillero. I know the look. And this? No kind of wood stove did this. All right. Keep it clean. It'll heal on its own. Leave a nasty scar. But I want you to come back and see me in a couple of days. You got it. Funny thing. When the city burned and the hordes came in, neighborhoods at war for decades all came together, fought together. Latinos, güeros, chinos, bloods, crips. Didn't matter. Crazy what it takes to bring people together sometimes, no? Thanks, Doc. St. John to Lieutenant Whitaker. Come back. Switching to a private channel. Hold on. Deacon, are you there? Yeah. Uh, hey, so I, I looked at that requisition form. It says that you want silicate? Yeah, silicate. I use it as a distilling medium in the column chromatographer. Ah, uh, column chrom... what? <sighs> Sorry, it's just... it's the one part of my research that's actually going well. So, silicate, where do I get it? Oh, shit, I thought I marked it on the rack. Hold on. Okay, there's this little general store southwest of us near Mazama Village. You should be able to find it there. Okay, got it. Thank you. Sorry, never mind. <clears throat> Carry on, Corporal. Yes, ma'am. Uh, Lieutenant. Sarah, out. Silicate. What the fuck is silicate, anyway? St. John, this is Captain Curry. Come in. Yeah, Captain. I'm here. Well, I just wanted to let you know that the Colonel gives an informal talk every day at dusk at the staging area where you were sworn in. Uh, yes, sir. Now, while these talks are informal, enlisted men and women are expected to attend. <clears throat> uh, copy that, sir. Curry out. All right. Commander who likes to give fireside chats. Can't wait. Deacon, are you there? Deacon. I'm here. Look, I know we have a lot to talk about. Ma'am? This is a private channel. Deacon. Okay. I want you to know that I meant what I said about... about you staying and helping. I know this can't be easy for you. Being here like this. Hey, uh, where else am I gonna go? And if I leave, they're gonna make me get back this really cool hat, so I'm starting to like this hat. I mean, really. <laughs> I bet. Okay. All right. Now I gotta get back to work. This yeast has already filled up like half a dozen petri dishes. Okay. Save me some of the viral proteins. I got an appetite out here. I'll do that. Lieutenant Whitaker out. Dozens of new recruits have joined our ranks. We welcome them. We do not care about the color of your skin. We do not care what country you were born in. We do not care if you are a man or a woman. We do not care if you are gay or lesbian or bisexual or transgender. These are things beyond your control. These are things that God has ordained. And we accept them. What we do not accept 
are liars, thieves, rapists, murderers, fornicators, adulterers, oath breakers, drug addicts, or criminals of any kind. From this life or the one before, how you conduct yourself, how you act in the eyes of God, these are things that you do control. Any soldier or officer found guilty of any transgression, no matter how small, will be brought here to this very scaffold and will be hanged by the neck until they are dead. This punishment may seem cruel to some of you, but you have my promise. Any punishment of ours is a great mercy compared to the punishment of God that is being unleashed on the world outside these walls. None of us is perfect. We do not expect perfection. What we do expect yeah. is obedience, yeah. order, and discipline. Give us these things, and we will win this war. Company dismissed. St. John, come in. Taylor, Dickens, St. John. Taylor, haven't heard from you in a while. I was afraid that maybe you'd gotten too close to that man you were tracking. Oh, I'm close, all right. I'm right in the friggin' backyard. Hey, I need your help, man. I'm, I'm at, the, at a small camp south of Crater Lake, just off the South Rim Drive. Taylor, listen to me. I have no idea what you're doing, but you got... Oh, shit! No, no, no! Let me go! Hey! No. Taylor? Taylor! Damn it! Come on, boy. I'll give up on it. Tell us where your camp is. Maybe we'll let you live. Fuck you. <laughs> Bring him down! I don't think he can hear us. Let's see if we can do something about that. I'm not telling you shit. Can you hear that? Get him the fuck out of here! Come on! What do you think? Maybe we could turn this in at that army camp and get some credits. out here. I've had better days, I'll be honest with you. Okay. Uh, Jesus. Okay, listen to me, pal. Take this, pull it against your head like that. Good. Okay. Now, I want you to uh, wait here. I'm gonna go radio uh, Captain Curry. He's gonna send someone to pick you up, all right? All right, man. Yeah, hell yeah. Captain Curry, this is Corporal St. John. Come back. This is Curry. I'm here with Lieutenant Whitaker, checking on your progress. Corporal. I've told Captain Curry that you're an immense help. I don't know what I would do without you. Oh, well, th thank you, dude. That's great. I, it's not why I'm checking in. Captain, uh, there's a marauder camp just off of South Rim Drive. Marauders? This close to the island? Uh, no, listen, no, 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 no. Um, I dealt with these bastards, but we have an injured man, Private Taylor. They fucking slice his ear off. Jesus, is he all right? Private Taylor? What was he doing out there? He's, yeah, he's gonna live. Look, no, no idea what he was doing out here. I need you to send docu uh, Captain Jimenez and some men to come out and get him. I'll send you the coordinates. 
I'll head up there now and let him know. Hurry up. Taylor, how you doing, buddy? Like I said, man, I've had better days. Uh, <laughs> hey, I think the bleeding stopped. Oh, no, no, it hasn't. Uh, help is on the way. You hang tight. Uh, you want me to come back? Wait with you. No, oh, oh, hell no, no, no. I mean, I, I already feel like it. I'll stop by the infirmary later. See how you can get that. Hey, I've seen that thing. It's pretty cushy. Way better than being out here, uh, let me tell you. <laughs> yeah, I've seen it too. Uh, don't give the doc too much trouble. Huh? You got that? Dig it out. Colonel, Corporal St. John reporting in, and I'm at the last location where Lieutenant Norwood was seen. Uh, he seems pretty fortified, sir. Are you, are you sure you want me to tackle this alone? Just follow orders, Corporal. Garrett out. Yes, sir. Fucking A. How the hell are you doing, Lieutenant? St. John. Thank God I'd given up hope. Oh, yeah? Well, a good friend of mine once told me, never give up hope, because you lose that. You may as well just pack it in. Keep that in mind next time I'm ambushed by a dozen squatters. You okay? All right, listen. Camp's clear and your bike's still in one piece, so can you just get back alone, huh? Yeah, I can handle it. Thank you, St. John. Sure. Now get going. Go. Colonel, sir, reporting in. It's, uh, well, oh, Jesus, it wasn't easy. But I got her out. Lieutenant Norwood is out. Good work, Corporal. Send the patrol out now. She said she could make it on her own, so, uh, I'll radio in later, make sure she made it. St. John out. Colonel, sir, just checking in on Lieutenant Norwood. Corporal, I've just read her report. She claims that you took on an entire drifter camp, single-handedly? Well, I wasn't about to leave her in there alone, sir. Very good, Corporal. Captain Curry has put your name in for a promotion. I'm beginning to see why. <sighs> this looks like the spot. Let's go find some silicate. All right, fellas, how you getting inside? <clears throat> Maybe up here. I should be able to climb up here. <laughs> <laughs> Silicate, this will work. Okay, now I just gotta find a way out of here. Oh, somebody didn't know what to... hmm? oh, Come on, you bitch. Yes. Yes. Okay. I'll just park this anywhere.
Sarah, are you there? I've um, got the silicate you requested. Corporal St. John, yes, I'm here. I'm in a meeting with Lieutenant Weaver. Corporal St. John? What are you doing another run for me? Uh, I don't know. Um... Weaver! Corporal, report in to me when you get back to the island. Lieutenant Whitaker out. Fucking Weaver now. What the fuck is he doing? Hey, Doc. You there? This is Corporal St. John, the Doc Jimenez. Come back. Oh, St. John. How's the arm? Good. Good. Uh, that ointment, or whatever it is that you gave me, it's some... Um, yeah, it's working great. I'll be the judge of that. Hey, so I'm actually just checking in to see, uh... Well, to see how well you know Lieutenant Weaver. Lieutenant Weaver? I know him... As well as I know any of the officers. Why? I don't know. I'm just, uh, I'm, I'm doing some runs for them, for him and Lieutenant Whitaker, and it just, it seems like he's, um, I don't know, he's, he's in her face all the time, and, uh, I don't fucking like it. <laughs> Lieutenant Whitaker can take care of herself. Listen to me, St. John. The Colonel tolerates a certain amount of razzing amongst the officers. If I were you... I'd stay out of it. All right, Doc. And don't worry about Lieutenant Weaver. He's no saint, but I've met worse. Him and his help. Weaver, I swear to God. What, are you afraid of a little competition? God, get out! Hey, is there a problem? Ma'am. Just a friendly discussion, Corporal. Lieutenant. What was that all about? <sighs> Nothing, it's just... Weaver, he thinks that the answer to everything is just to burn it all to the ground. God, fuck him. Yeah, fuck him. Here. No, don't. What now, Deacon? Thank me. Don't thank me. Every time you thank me, I end up outside with another one of your bullshit requisition forms. My bullshit? I, That's what you think this is? I, that everything I, I that I'm doing is just that. bullshit? No! Of course you didn't mean it. You know, I don't understand why you're still here. Well, then let me enlighten you. I spent the last two years killing freaks. One by one, up close, so close that I could smell the flesh rotting between their teeth. So if you're working on something here that's gonna take them all out at once, fuck it, I'm in. But if you don't want me here, you know what? Just give the order, ma'am. Deacon, wait. I'm sorry, okay? Look, I, I do need... I just... <sighs> Thank... I appreciate your help. St. John, you there? Yeah, I'm here. This is Lieutenant Weaver. Have you even looked at my requisition form yet? I see you doing runs for the witch almost every day. I'm starting to feel left out. Yeah, yeah, I mean, yeah, yes, sir. Polystyrene, you need polystyrene, right? Yeah, that's right, polystyrene. If you're having trouble finding it, there's a wrecked truck down on Highway 97, south of Chamot, beneath the water tower. Think you can find it? I'm not... Look, I'll find it, the wrecked truck, okay? I'll get you your, uh, polystyrene. See that you do. Many of you have been with me from the beginning. Listen to me when I warned about the coming of God's plague. Journeyed with me to this place. Helped me to build this ark. But whether you were with us from the beginning, or joined our ranks only today, you are now part of this great endeavor. You are now part of our mission to save mankind. 
I want to remind you, as you go forth beyond these walls to perform your duties, that we are still searching for material worthy of safekeeping within the Ark. We seek textbooks, manuals, encyclopedia, discs, and other media. Lieutenant Weaver has listed several books on chemistry that are needed. Lieutenant Whitaker has listed books on biochemistry, genetics, and biology that we are lacking. Captain Jimenez has listed books on medicine, anatomy, and surgical procedures that we need. Sergeant Tomlinson has listed books on highway construction, mechanical engineering. And Captain Hawkins is always looking for material related to agriculture and hydroponics. So, while you're out doing runs, keep an eye out for items like these. Do your part to help us fill the Ark. Company dismissed. St. John to Whitaker, I, uh... Uh, Corporal St. John, yes. Matt, the Colonel is here. I was just telling him how helpful you've been. Corporal St. John? Yes. Lieutenant Whitaker has been singing your praises. Just doing my job, Colonel. Uh, sir? I'm glad. Lieutenant Whitaker's work is well behind schedule, perhaps with your help. Matt, I told you. Look, biology, the work that I'm doing, is far more complicated than just building a bomb. Weaver is... Lieutenant Weaver is ahead of schedule. If you don't make similar progress, I'm going to have to pull resources from you and give them to him. Is that clear, Lieutenant? Yes, sir, Colonel. Carry on. Uh, is everything okay? It sounds a lot like... Sorry, I have to go. Colonel, I'm at the location where she was last spotted. You found her? Not yet, but uh, I see an abandoned militia bike, so uh, she can't have gone far. Very good, Corporal. Carry out your orders. Garrett out. Okay, what happened? Uh, the bike broke down, and you weren't too happy about that. I don't blame you. Uh, small boot prints. That's got to be hers. Uh, they're heading this way. Oh, what's that? She must have dropped something. What did you drop, Crystal? Because whatever it was, you wanted it back real bad, didn't you? What is this? A ring? Okay, I got one of them back. More boot prints this way. This is it. What's this? Oh, yellow snow. I mean, shit, if you gotta go, you gotta go. You ain't concerned about anything out here, are you, Crystal? More boot prints in this way. <laughs> oh, good, I'm marauders. Are these your friends, Crystal? Because they don't look too friendly. Oh, oh yeah, that's all. That did it. Oh, man, you keep picking the wrong friends. Screw you. Hey, hey, you, you don't remember me? Oh, I remember you. Standing up on the stage, kissing the colonel's ass like a good little soldier. Well, Jesus Christ, do you know why I'm here? <laughs> I figure the son of a bitch colonel put a bounty on my head. So do it already. I don't give a shit. What the hell are you doing? I'm not gonna kill you. I just... I need the rings. Those are my goddamn rings. The son of a bitch has stolen from me. They're mine! Yeah, yeah, they are. But it's either the rings or your life. So what's it gonna be? You can go to hell! You're welcome. There ain't no more gratitude in this world. Okay, I'll take these back to the Colonel. Colonel, sir, reporting in. I'm, uh, returning the stolen property. Corporal? Yes, the worker. 
Common thief and murderer. Did she put up a fight? Yes, sir. Yes, yes, she did. Uh, she put up a hell of a fight, but it was nothing that I couldn't handle. You fight on the side of righteousness, Corporal. Don't give it another thought. It is those like her, liars, thieves, murderers, drug addicts, criminals all, who brought this scourge down upon us. I will not weep to see them gone, every one. Dismissed, Corporal. Yes, sir. I'll, I'll get back to work. Now that's a gun. Lord Tower. This is it. It's gotta be here somewhere. God damn it. Okay. Now I just gotta find Weaver's shit. Polystyrene. <laughs> this ought to do it. I'll mark the rest on my map. Have Corey send some men out here to get the rest. Corporal St. John, this is Colonel Garrett. Report. Yes, sir. Corporal, yes. This is of the utmost urgency. A soldier, an officer, has gone AWOL. Uh, an officer? A traitor of the worst kind. He murdered two enlisted men and stole a bike from the motor pool. He's been spotted on the South Rim Drive. The stolen bike has a blue tank. Find him, Corporal. Yes, sir. I'll, I'll chase him down. Corporal, bring him back. Alive. Alive, sir. We're going to hang him, Corporal. An example for anyone who thinks they are above militia regulations. Who thinks they are above the laws of God. Uh, yes, sir. Dismiss, Corporal. Which way? You're mine now. Colonel, I spotted him. That's him, all right. Remember, Corporal, I want him alive. Yes, sir. Damn it! No! You can't get away from me! Shoot the bike, Deke! Shoot the bike! Don't let him get away, Deke. What the hell? Going AWOL is one thing, but you didn't have to murder two men to do it. Uh, Michael, please, just let me go. I'll, I'll tell you where I stashed you, I swear. Sorry, pal. I told to the Colonel. Colonel, Freaks. I've got him. Freaks. Alive. Transmitting coordinates now. Freaks. Corporal, good. I'm sending a patrol now. Report oh. back to me. Garrett out.
Hey, I uh, got the shit you were asking for. Oh, good, good. Set it down over there. Let me get a piece. Okay. That's good. So how are things going with Lieutenant Whitaker? How do you mean? <laughs> I see you coming and going, man. You're doing a lot of runs for her. Yeah, I'm just doing my job. <laughs> okay, man. Yeah, I tried to hit that once when I first got here. Is that right? Oh, yeah, dude. I mean, that lady's got a fine ass. I'm an ass man. I can't help myself. Yeah, yeah. How'd that work out for you? Well, not too good. I mean, she threw me down on the ground, tried to break my goddamn arm. Listen up. You need to watch yourself with her. That lady's intense. I'm gonna keep that in mind. Uh, you know anything else? Uh, no, but grab these and follow me. You see, polystyrene is an aromatic hydrocarbon, while gasoline is made up of simple aliphatic hydrocarbons. You try saying that. Anyway, mix the two together, all those molecular chains break up into single covalent bonds. Yeah, everybody knows that. That, my friend, is a napalm molotov, <laughs> and that is how we're gonna win this war. Once I fine-tune the formula, that shit's gonna burn hotter than an acetylene torch! <laughs> know how hot that is? Yeah, I got a pretty good idea. I worked in an auto shop. Do you need anything else? Nah, man. I'm good. So goddamn close. <laughs> Kaboom! <laughs> gonna blow up and burn, son! Taking it to the ass! Sarah. Yeah, just um, put it on the counter, will you? Okay. I'm, I'm sorry. It's... This is just really frustrating for me sometimes. I wouldn't know. Uh, I, I just need another requisition form. No, you know what? I'm, I, I'm not going to give this one to you. Why? Why not? So I'm gonna go with you this time. Let's go. Come on, soldier. See if you can keep up with me. Yeah, right. When's the last time you went on a run? I mean, you know, out in the shit. Hey, I've done supply runs like anyone else. Though I gotta admit, it's been a while. Do you even have a bike? Yeah. But, uh, I think I'm gonna ride with you on this run. No chance of us getting separated that way. Yes, ma'am. Stop with the... Hey, you, uh, you been inside the Ark yet? Uh, the cave's here. Yeah, I got the grand tour when I arrived. From the Colonel himself. Come on, even you gotta give the man some credit. For the vision, stockpiling, preparing, saving what we can. Yeah, well, I'll give him this. This island is a goddamn fortress. Nothing's gonna get in here without a hell of a fight. Exactly. Here, this is my tent. Wow, nice place. It's got that woman's touch. Oh, right. I'm hardly ever here, and most nights I usually spend it on a cot in the lab. Look at this. This'll get the job done. It was a gift from Matt when I first joined up. Matt? The Colonel. Jesus, come on, Deacon. It's just a gun. Come on. Let's go this way. I want to show you something. Following you. When I got here, the militia had cut down almost every tree on the island. I asked Matt, the colonel, to save the last one. 
Oh, yeah? Well, why did you, uh, do that? Do you remember the weekend we rode up here? To Crater Lake, I mean, after we got married. Uh, yeah, I, I, I remember. I remember thinking, God, when Mount Mazama blew up, how long did it take for the lava to cool and the soil to form, all these trees to grow? When all this is over, when we leave this fucking island, I want there to be at least one tree left. Uh, listen, these guys don't give a shit about any of that. I've, I've been through their dead zone. Look, the Colonel's focused on winning the war. The sooner I do my part, the sooner he'll stop burning everything to the ground. <clears throat> What's wrong? No, nothing, it's just... Never mind. Hold on, uh... Hold on tight. I remember. There's a community college east of here, off the highway. You know the one? Yeah, yeah. Uh, let's take the south bridge. It'll be faster. I'm with you. Hey, so I gotta ask, uh, all this stuff, the, the yeast, the silicon... Why do I need it? The weapon I'm working on is a viricide. If I can isolate the virus that causes the cells to mutate, I can kill it. Okay. Can I ask you something? After that night in Farewell, what happened? I mean, how did you get out? Well, we almost didn't. After the feds pulled out, anyone still alive started putting up roadblocks of their own, and they started shooting people on sight. We somehow made it to that refugee camp where we, where we thought that you were going to be waiting, but like I said, it was gone. So we tried a few others, same story, no survivors, everything overrun. So within a week, the whole damn valley was a war zone. People were killing each other over scraps of food, sometimes killing each other for no reason at all. If Boozer and I hadn't stuck together, I don't think we would have made it. Wait, Boozer? He's alive? Where is he? What happened to him? Yes, he's alive, but he's he's at a camp up north. He can't ride anymore because because he lost his arm. But, uh, but he is alive. I'm so glad he's alive. I, I'm really sorry. I, I should have asked you about him sooner. Don't worry about it. Okay, uh, my turn. Look, this is gonna sound stupid, but, um, but that night in Farewell, my mongrel's ring, do you still have it? Deacon, I'm sorry. It's the Colonel's policy. They, they confiscate all jewelry when you come into the camp. They melt down the gold and silver to use in Weaver's project or whatever the hell. I forgot all about it. I'm, I'm really sorry. Uh, no, don't worry about it. I don't know. I was just thinking out loud. It doesn't matter. I think this is it. <laughs> You've been here before? Once. Before, you know, career day. They invited me to give a presentation on exciting careers in biochemistry. <laughs> what? Nothing, just... Looking back, it should have been a talk on how to survive the end of the world. Come on. How are we gonna get through this? Should we find a way around? No, uh, hold on. I can boost you up there. You ready? Yeah. Uh, you got it? <laughs> Got it. Here, watch your head. Got it. Jesus, what the hell happened here? This is one of the earliest survivor camps. Set up before they figured out that hordes like to run along the main highways. It was dead long before I got here. This entire place is gonna be crawling. Yeah. 
Do you know where we're going? Like I said, I've only been here once, but I think the science building is back there. Ah, damn it, Roots. Wait, 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 wait a second. What's wrong? Well, I mean, I don't want to bring the whole place down in this. We don't even know what's in there. Well, we know what's in there, but you goddamn knew this. Come on, let's just go around. Place up pretty good. How about through here? The door's locked, but it doesn't look barricaded. Can you jimmy it? Here, let me try. I think I can get this there. That did it. Through here looks clear. Coming. Here, uh, help me move this. Hold on, okay. You ready? Push! Are you ready? Yeah, let's go. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Yeah. All right, well, why don't you find another way? No, wait a second, wait a second. We can do this. What? We can do this. Uh... We both go out there. We're just gonna pull them down on top of each other, so... Wait a second, what if... You come up on top of here. You lay down cover and fire. <laughs> you take out the strikers, I'll take out the rest. Are you sure about this? Yeah, 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 I do this all the time. Just keep up a steady stream of fire, all right? Deacon. Once I'm through... Just close this up. down. It's clear. You okay? God, Jesus, that was a little too close. No, we had it all the way. Gunfire's gonna bring in more. Yeah, we'll be long gone by then. Where now? Uh, I don't know. Uh, they got the place barricaded up pretty good. Uh, see if there's a hole in any of these walls. Place where we can climb up. All right, I'll look over here. Anything? Hey, over here, there's an open window. Coming. <clears throat> you got it? <clears throat> yeah, yeah, I got it. Hold on, let me find something. Ah, uh, Sarah? Hold on, I gotta find something I can throw down. Oh, shit! Deacon! Oh, shit, shit, shit! God damn it! Uh, just find something for me to climb on! I'm on it! Ooh, there we go. Deacon, here! <laughs> oh, God. Why are we laughing? I don't know. <sighs> you know, I am... I remember you were always trying to talk me into going back to school. Oh, yeah, well... And now you finally got your way. <laughs> well, better late than never. Oh, okay. Thanks. You ready? Mm-hmm. Let's go. All right. Here, let me go first this time. Yes, ma'am. Whatever you say. It's like a bomb went off in here. Maybe one did. Come on, I think we can get through here. The door's jammed. Here, here, here. No, no, I got this, I got it. See, I told you. See? I 
Like I said, I got this. Yeah. Yeah. Good job. Thanks. So, uh, how badly do you need this piece of equipment? All right, we're almost there. Look, we're not giving up now. I'm just asking. We know how the freaks were getting in. Someone needed to learn how to park. It looks clear. Shit. More barricades, and they're everywhere. Huh. Uh, check the buildings. I can see the science building. It's over there. Just gotta get through these barriers. Hey! Another open window. Got it. Here, let me boost you up again. Uh, only this time you... Don't take so long finding something for you to climb. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Got it! Okay, hold on. Hey, and try not to attract any more swarmers this time, all right? Sure, yeah, I'll see what I can do. Get off of me! Sarah! 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 No! Damn it. No. Sarah. Sarah! Sarah! Hey. God. Oh my God. There's... There's so many of them. Coming. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You're okay. Come on. I'm fine. Come on, we're almost there. This is the science building. Yeah, it looks like this place has been shut up tight from the inside. Come on, there's got to be a way in. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah. I've killed Freaks before. Oh, I know, I know. It's just... Deacon, I'm fine. Let's go. Let's check this door. Can you open it? <sighs> no, it's jammed from the inside. Let's go around the building. There has to be a way in. Well, I'm telling you, someone sealed it tight from the inside. Well, we gotta check, right? I guess not. <clears throat> oh, God damn it! Hey, hey, it's okay. It's sure jammed like all the rest. Another way. <laughs> Hold on for a second. Those are... Those are newts. They're inside. Those are newts in there, which means... There's gotta be a way from the roof. Come on. Come on, the roof's low over here. Yep, we just have to find a way up. Yeah, yeah, hold up. You got it? Yeah. Okay, be ready. Newts can get pretty nasty when you trespass on their territory. I just really wish we didn't have to kill the little shits. What? What do you mean? You remind me of that little girl. The one in Farewell. The one that fucking stamped you. She didn't know what she was doing. None of them know what they're doing. Won't stop them from killing you. I know that. the 
rest of them. You enjoyed that? Well, I kill a newt? No, but... I mean, you gotta admit, they're pretty goddamn annoying. You're right about that. Here, give me your hand. Okay. Careful. Steady. I got this. All right. But they smell like shit. Yeah, well, you try living like them. See how you smell after two years. No, thanks. Where, where, where are we going? Try these doors. Uh, one of these is gonna be a Over here. Is this that the uh, centrifuge you were looking for? Yep, this is it. Come on. Okay. Let's do this. Any more of those smoke grenades? Yeah. From up here, you can see the entire park. I watch where I'm going, and then you throw the grenades ahead of me. You got it? Got it. Okay, let's do this.
You all right? Am I all right? What's wrong with you? Oh, I don't know. It's just that I remember the day that I met you. You fired my gun in the air to scare up those rednecks, and you're so scared you couldn't stop shaking. Yeah, well, a lot's changed since then. <clears throat> Come on, let's get the hell out of here. What, uh, happened to you, Sarah? What's that supposed to mean? Hey, look, I get it. A lot's changed. Everyone we knew is gone, but it doesn't explain. Explain what, Deacon? Why everyone in the good old boys club calls me the Wizard Island Witch? Look, I don't give a shit about any of that. I... Nothing's happened to me that hasn't happened to every other fucking person on this planet. Yeah. Okay. If you say so. This way. Right behind you. <clears throat> Can I say thank you? No. Okay. You know, I just wanted to let you know how much I needed this. <laughs> 